good afternoon and welcome back it's been a long time again uh, I think it's over six months since I was last out to a match uh, which would have been yeah, Samut Sakon versus Nongbua and I'm off to Kasetsa uh, this evening today's game is the last game of the M150 championship season and it's uh, Kasetsa against Nongbua Nongbua uh, are going up. They've won the M150 Championship this season. Uh, when I went to Smootsakon in September, uh, they put away Smootsakon really at a canter, so it looked like it was going to be uh, a good season for them, and they've kept that going. Uh, we've had we had like a second wave uh, of the pandemic, so the Thai League shut down again. Uh, so this is now getting on for April 2021, but we're still playing. Uh, the 2020 season so this is the last game of the 2020 season uh, and then they're gonna stop for three months I think and then I think they're coming back to start 2021 season in July uh, and I think the plan is that they're going to uh, try and do things more in the style of a European league and have the season run from you know July August until May uh, the following year uh, to try and align more with the European calendar for football anyway. So yeah, it's been a, another break in play this year. It's been a stop-start, stop-start season. So when I was uh, when I was in Smootsakon in September, the, uh, the capacity of games was getting up to 50% being allowed back in. And uh, they were aiming for 75%. And then Smootsakon, uh, which is where I was for that game, uh, was actually kind of where the second outbreak started uh, so this was just about a week before Christmas so everything kind of went into lockdown for another month Thai football stopped again uh, then it restarted again about six weeks ago uh, with no fans uh, and they've sort of eked it back up to 25% capacity uh, which is how it is at the moment and uh, yeah, so they're ending the season with 25% capacity games. I've not been able to go and see another port game. So this 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 uh, this season, 2020 season, I've only managed three videos, and two of them are going to be uh, Nongbua. So 66% in favour of the of the pink of the pink fighting cocks. So I'm going to get on the BTS. I'm near Central Lab Trail. Uh, I'm gonna, there's a new BTS station that actually goes quite close to where I need to go for tonight's game uh, so I'm gonna jump on the BTS in a minute and uh, yeah I'll see you guys at Cassette Hi there I'm walking around the campus now at Cassette University and uh, just trying to find where the stadium is I think if I keep going the direction I am um, I shouldn't be too wrong um, I had some issues trying to buy my ticket today uh, cassette uh, of like a lot of Thai teams are using this sort of centralized online ticket in so there's one uh, ticket website you can go to to buy tickets for like concerts events um, obviously different sporting fixtures and yeah it, to be fair it was quite quick to register and buy a ticket for the match and then the idea is that you can go down to your nearest 7-Eleven and just print off the ticket I buy the ticket and print it off so I paid my 150 baht and then spent another hour in 7-Eleven uh, because they couldn't print my ticket so after a lot of uh, faffing around they basically told me to uh, basically just come to the stadium with my receipt and they should be able to print my ticket uh, hopefully that's going to be the case because it will be uh, a bit rubbish if I've come all this way with my receipt and my ID um, and they still can't let me in the match because I don't think it's going to be mega busy. So Cassette were playing um, at TOT which is like the Thai Telecom uh, facility. Uh, that's where I went a couple of years ago or well, first time I saw Nongbo actually but now they've uh, managed to upgrade the facilities a bit here back at Cassette University so uh, yeah now they're playing their home games at home so to speak 
so yeah well, there's all these different faculties dotted around there's the as we look over here we've got the faculty of, uh, of economics faculty of business administration this big building over here so I'm just looking for the athletics facility which is where the stadium will be so I'm going to keep wandering around aimlessly and hopefully uh, next time I pop up I'll be in front of the stadium Friends, that's a good start. So there's the stadium, and uh, this is a new one. Uh, things I've seen at the stadiums, and it's also got its own beach volleyball section. There you go for the players. Uh, can have a quick game of beach volleyball uh, when they want to warm up at half time, I guess. Uh, got about 20 minutes until kick off managed to source some beer uh, because this is a stadium inside university grounds uh, alcohol selling is a bit of a no-no so uh, people have kind of bought their own uh, that's all good with me so uh, yeah I've been already told off for having a camera and the GoPro in my bag but uh, to be fair my phone's a pretty good camera so I'm gonna kind of stick to this I think which is a shame but uh, so be it Got some more pool fans. Nongbua looked to cap off this championship run very nicely. 1-0 Nongbua. Almost half time here at Cassette Start Stadium. Still 1-0 to Nongbua. Uh, very kind of typical end of season feel to this match. Uh, don't think Kazakh Start really have anything to play for either. Uh, everyone's just enjoying themselves but it's nice to be back at football and everyone's having a good time. to Gregory! So there's actually someone here practicing archery. They've actually got, so as well as beach volleyball over the other side we've got archery practice going on over here. Half time here at the I don't know what to call this, Kasatsa University Athletic Facility, 1-0 uh, to Nongbua. They've pretty much been in control, uh, but yes, yeah, both sides aren't really going for it too much because it's just the end of the season and uh, I think everyone just wants a rest. They've been playing for over a year, so this, this season actually kicked off February 2020. We've had two lockdowns, um, fans have come back, fans have been sent away again, they've had yeah, um, it's dragged on, but here we are, Nongbura are on course for the championship, and uh, they're one new up here, so just going to try and grab a beer and get back in there for the second half.
Newton on board. A uh, free kick went straight over the keeper into the net. Slide the free kick right over the goalkeeper's head, and it's 2 0 to Nandua. About 10 minutes into the second half. And uh, the championship part is well and truly underway here. Only a few minutes left. And the uh, celebrations are beginning. I've been given some Thai whiskey. They've snuck in some Thai whiskey. Which. Uh, now put hairs on the chest. So, uh, chin chin. จันทวงย้อนหลังตั้งปอมเปิดมอมมาได้โมงว่าสามประตูต่อศูนย์ครับโอ้โหลงไปไม่ทันเลยไปตีบินซิงช์ไซม์และนงบัวจะทำให้Header into the corner, three 0 to Nongbua. Uh, that's the icing on the cake. Nongbua going up with a convincing win to catch things up. tonight's video, Kassin Sart versus Nongbua. Uh, when I went to that first Kassin Sart Nongbua game, I think 2017, um, I said at the time I'll keep an eye on Nongbua and maybe one day they'll make it to the Thai Premier League. And uh, yeah, they've, they've done it with aplomb. They absolutely smashed through the, uh, the Thai second division this year. So first time in their history, they'll be going up to the Thai Premier League next year. And uh, they moved into their new stadium a couple of months before Christmas. So everything's kind of set up just nicely for them. It'll be interesting to see how they get on next season. Um, yeah, this football season, I think the 2021 season might kick off in July. We'll see. Uh, nothing's been confirmed yet. So yeah, hopefully everyone's keeping safe out there and uh, it will be back to a more normal football season uh, for 2021 with fans, all the fans allowed back in. And uh, I'll see you all when that's all back up again. So. Uh, please like and subscribe and I'll see you uh, hopefully not too uh, not too far away into the future. Goodbye for now.